Birdman and the Galaxy Trio originally aired on September 9, 1967 on NBC. Its original air date on Toonami is unknown because it was aired on Cartoon Roulette, which is something I covered in a separate video. The structure of the series is a little odd. It's still the regular 22-minute length episode, but the first 7-8 to eight minutes is a Birdman episode, followed by a 5-6 to six minute Galaxy Trio episode, and finishes with another 7-8 to eight minute Birdman episode. Now, while I didn't watch the whole series, I did watch half of it. I jumped around the series and watched random episodes. Birdman is a series about a superhero who gets superpowers from the sun god Ra and defeats various supervillains around the globe, while Galaxy Trio is about a small superhero team that travels the galaxy solving whatever crises they come across. The writing for these shows are pretty formulaic, as is standard for 60s Hanna-Barbera cartoons. There's nothing particularly interesting about either of these series. The voice acting is also pretty bland. Keith Andes, Don Messick, Ted Cassidy, and Virginia Eiler play our leads, whom all do decent jobs, and the guest stars do pretty alright, too. There's just not much to the performances, mostly because there's not much to work with. The animation is about what you'd expect for the time, and there's nothing I can really fault it for. And of course the designs are done by the legendary Alex Toth. While I still think his Space Ghost designs will be his greatest original superhero designs, he does really good work here, too. After looking at this series, I gotta say I'm not too impressed. There's not much to it, and admittedly it was a chore to get through, even though I just watched half of it. I give Birdman and the Galaxy Trio a 6 out of 10. Next time on the Toonami Retrospective, I'll be reviewing the 1967 Fantastic Four cartoon. Thanks for watching.